Hello everyone, I'm Tiff Rayner and welcome to the world of light music. Yes, hello everyone and welcome to another program in the series The World of Light Music. On today's program we have some American light orchestras, Percy Faith, David Rose and Paul Weston, who all recorded a plenty in the 50s and 60s. We'll hear from them as well as the usual mix of vintage discs, bands and vocals. But first from the showtime section of the Paxton Mood Music Library comes this fast-moving little piece of light orchestral music written by Cyril Waters. Let's open our program today with Top of the Bill. Short and sweet, top of the bill, opened our program today. Band time, and it's the band of Her Majesty's Royal Marines with the Robert Farnan composition, State Occasion. This music was written in the 40s by Farman for the production music libraries. As you will hear, it has a distinct ceremonial sound and was used in many a newsreel that backed events of a royal flavour.
What a big piece of music that is. Her Majesty's Royal Marines, the band of Her Her Majesty's Royal Marines, played Robert Farnan's State Occasion. You're listening to the world of light music. Here's a wide, broad piece of mood music also from the Paxton Library, written by King Palmer and called Royal Gala. This music was recorded in the early 50s. Gala, composed by King Palmer, and that came from the Paxton Library, recorded in the early 1950s. The show West Side Story contains some beautiful music written by Leonard Bernstein, including Somewhere, recorded in 1960 by Percy Faith and his orchestra. This arrangement of Somewhere is by Percy Faith also. Thank you. 
From West Side Story, we listened in to Somewhere, played by Percy Faith and his orchestra. You're listening to The World of Light Music, and I'm Tiff Rayner. Charles Williams is no stranger to this program. This great composer of production or mood music, as well as film scores, created some most beautiful descriptive music through his career years. One such piece is called The Starlings, and depicts just that. Listen now to The Starlings, played by Charles Williams and his concert orchestra. The recording was cut in 1953. What a beautiful little piece of descriptive mood music that was. Called Starlings, or The Starlings, it was composed by Charles Williams and played there on that old 78 by Charles Williams and his concert orchestra. Back now to Percy Faith and his orchestra and the cute little tune called Petite. This recording was made for the Columbia label back in 1954. Thank you. 
there it was, a cute little piece of music called Petite, played by Percy Faith and his orchestra and taken from an old 78 made back in 1954. Now here's an orchestral march from the Paxton Mood Music Catalogue called On the Barrack Square. This music was composed by George Saker and recorded in the 1940s. <laughs> about that for a rousing orchestral march on the barrack square that was called and recorded back in the 1940s you're listening to the world of light music the mood or production music libraries held hundreds of short bright little pieces of light orchestral music to fit every scene created by a radio or television producer dozens of composers worked tirelessly to fill the lists of the publishing companies who employed them This piece of music called Sewing Circle was recorded by Ray Martin and his orchestra half a century ago and was included in the Paxton Library. Thank you. 
That bright little piece of music called Sewing Circle, and that was played by Ray Martin and his orchestra. The delightful strings of David Rose and his orchestra are here to entertain us now with an arrangement by David Rose of California Melodies. This old disc was cut for the MGM label in the 1950s. What a lovely little piece of light music that is. California Melodies, played by David Rose and his orchestra. That's all we've time for today. Thank you for your company over the past 30 minutes, and I'll be back again for more from the world of light music. The World of Light Music is produced and presented each week by Tiff Rayner for Melbourne's Golden Days Radio, 95.7 FM.